not hype, but history. And what we're going to see today is one of the mightiest leap forward that this process has seen in almost 15 years. And the people responsible for, for that are not the British Prime Minister or the Taoiseach, Ian Paisley, Gerry Adams or myself. The people chiefly responsible for that are the people who voted for this in the recent Assembly elections. It was their will that Ian Paisley and Gerry Adams, the DUP and Sinn Féin, come together to put these institutions in place. And that's what we're going to do today. We're going to share power. We're going to form the All-Ireland Ministerial Council, which will meet probably in Armagh before the end of June. And we will drive forward to deliver for the people who put us in these very powerful positions. Uh, while this is a sad day, and it's a sad day for those who were the innocent victims of all the troubles we've had, yet it is a special day because we're making a new beginning. And I believe we're starting on a road which will bring us back uh, to peace and to prosperity. And I would challenge the people of Northern Ireland to rise to the challenge today and be determined that, come what may, will make this a country when all men and women will be equal under the law and equally subject to the law. <laughs> so you're, you're all you, you're reading in with the, the briefs and preparing for it and everybody else got a lot of it. Yeah, that's good. A busy when, period. When, when you're going out as a young man, I'm coming on like an hour. I should maybe have learned a lesson from you just kept going until I was 80. <laughs> well, I don't want to miss your talks with me. <laughs> well, actually, I will, as a matter of fact. It's all certainly that. Uh, being, I, you, you know, it's a funny thing, but even at the most difficult periods, I've always found people personally very friendly here. Oh, yeah. You know, and, and that's, well, I that's wonder why people hate me, because I'm such a nice man. When troubles come And my heart burden be can be.